In our top stories tonight, at least three women in the past month have been victims of attempted rapes or abductions. Could there be another rapist on the loose in the TCI? Our Angie Toussaint did some investigating and also found out the details behind the recent landing of a vessel of illegal immigrants in TCI waters. Let's take a look. According to recent publications in the Weekly News and a recent feature on WIV4, two ladies miraculously escaped an attempted abduction on Saturday, May 3rd on the Leeward Highway. The two ladies of Dominican nationality were pictured in the Weekly newspaper with bruises and abrasions on their bodies, and according to the article, the woman had to jump from a speeding vehicle to escape harm. WIV4 News contacted police officials and until press time was unable to get a comment. The article suggests that the women were walking on the Leeward Highway heading to the IGA supermarket when they were offered a lift by a man in a white pickup truck. The story goes on to say that the man passed the supermarket and continued on the Leeward Highway and took the woman to a secluded beach track. According to the article, one of the ladies took her phone to call the police and the man knocked it out of her hand, which resulted into a struggle. The woman later jumped out of the vehicle and continued on the Leeward Highway where they were later picked up and taken to the Murder Rigby Health Complex. Police also say that on May 6th, a lone mass gunman entered the home in Millennium Highway and robbed the home of $500 in cash and a blue Haitian passport. Police reports show that the Haitian woman was abducted from her home and taken by foot to the Bushes and Dockyard in Q-Town, where the female managed to escape from the gunman and ran back to her residence where she was met by police and taken to the Murder Rigby Health Complex. She was treated and sustained minor injuries to her feet from running on sharp rocks and was later released. According to police, a Haitian male is currently assisting with this investigation. Meanwhile, SPICE officials rounded up 47 illegal immigrants earlier this morning. The Special Police Immigration and Customs Enforcement Team began their crackdown on illegal immigrants as of 5 a.m., and their operations lasted until 10 a.m., in which Haitians, Dominicans, and Colombians were apprehended and sent to the South Dog Detention Center for processing. They will be immediately repatriated, according to a press release from the Royal Turks and Caicos Police Force. For WIV4 News, I'm Andy Jusaint. Thanks, Angie. Very scary. Ladies, it's never a bad idea to protect yourself in any event. Simple things like being aware of your surroundings and not traveling alone could save your life. 